bucks are on their feet. They're definitely chasing does right now. We got two hours before dark, and Joe with Alps and I are out into this walk-in area. The rut is on in South Dakota, and we're gonna see if we, luck be on our side, we're gonna get a mature buck. Um, in our sights, we can get a, a spot and stalk as we're doing. We're kind of on a bluff overlooking this bottom. I mean, this is some gorgeous country. Yeah, I'm on it. Yeah. Above him, above him. Above him? Yep. Just above him. You got him. Should have rearranged it. What's that? So I should have rearranged it. I was thinking it was three. I lost him. Did you come back up that draw? No, nope, I don't see him. Either. I we're thinking that Joe just smacked that buck. Three fifty. 359. 359. And uh, Nate thinks it's a good hit, but it's <laughs> now we got about 45 minutes of daylight left. So we gotta, we're gonna go down there and try to, you know, verify that we he sh hit the deer, recover it. There's a really good knob that we can come over the top looking down into a pretty small draw. Good shooting, buddy. <laughs> 359 yards with that, the horny 200 grain. Yep, horny precision hunter. Yeah, sweet deal. Well, let's let's get our hands on that bad boy. I hadn't seen one quite die like that. <laughs> it's like he's high fiving one last time. Congratulations. Nice job. So that's it. He's got a really cool inside point where he busted this. We have got Joe's deer. Packed, strapped, cut up, and in the packs. And uh, old Nate did one whale of a job, get the head off and get the hide off so it's ready for to be euroed up. And now we got our little, some work to do, Joe. But it's I say congratulations bit. on your shot. Way Thank to go. You. That, was a, that was a fun, fun evening on the, the prairie was good to us. Absolutely.